guys! I just wanted to do a little roundup video for the month of May. But first of all, I wanted to apologize. Sorry, I've been a little MIA. I have moved, and then I was super busy with school. Like, school kicked my butt this last semester. Um, I took two classes, and they were intense. So I've been super busy with that, and super busy with my own business, and and then I, I, I mentioned I moved. It was a really last-minute move. And so I just have been totally off the charts for this page. And I apologize. I totally left you guys hanging. I want you to know that if I am a very inconsistent person, and I try my best to be consistent, and the only way I know how to be consistent is by making lists and doing my calendar. And when I moved, all this got packed. So I my consistency dropped. So... I want you guys to know that you guys can text me and call me at any time. My job as your leader is to help you succeed. My job as your leader is to help you reach your goals. And one way I can do that is I have to know what your goals are. So make sure that you guys are telling me your goals. If it's a financial goal, if it's just you want to build a team goal. Um, now we have our awesome summer power up incentive trip. So that's a great goal. So, um, I'm going to do another video on goals. So, I have to know what your goals are. And I want you guys to know that I am here for you at all times. The easiest way to contact me is through messaging on Facebook or text message. Just simply because I am um, with my kids a lot and phone calls can just get really loud and obnoxious. And it's like a lot of, hold on, boy, stop what you're doing. And it's just a lot of interruptions. So, it's easier if you just Facebook me. Or you can text me. Um, my number, you guys should all have my number. If you don't have it, just message me on Facebook and I will give it to you. Um, I was about to give you my number. This video is going on YouTube. I don't want the whole YouTube universe having my number. <laughs> okay, so um, anyways, back to what I was saying. So I want you guys to know that I'm here for you. So if you need anything and you haven't heard from me, just let me know. I know your numbers. I know who's going to be um, an active and who's not. I know who's close to promoting and who's not. So ask for questions. No question is dumb. I do ask that if it is a question concerning like the catalog or... Um, okay, I'm sorry. I do ask that before you do ask the question, try to do your own research. There are so many resources in the resource tab of our workstation that can answer your questions. So try to be a little self-sufficient, do your research. Um, a lot of questions are already in your consultant guide. So make sure that you guys are familiar with that. If you're not, make sure it's where you can get to it easily. So back to topic. Um, my phone mute. My husband always seems to call me right when I'm doing a video. Okay, so topic one. We're going to talk about the Cincy specials. I looked at you guys' PRB for May, and some of you guys are doing awesome. Some of you guys are not doing so great, and I kind of want to encourage you guys. I mean, we, we, you invested $100 into this business. You didn't waste $100 just to sit around and do nothing, so make sure you're doing something. I mean, this to me, that's a complete waste of money, unless you just did it to get the products. If you did that, then great. Let me know, so I'll stop writing your butt. But you invested $100 in this business, which means that you wanted to make more money. Um, <clears throat> so why aren't you doing that? You know, Why aren't you out there trying to get sales? Why aren't you pushing parties? Why aren't you doing the very best you can? And I'm going to tell you because you're scared and you shouldn't be scared. You shouldn't feel like you're nervous and scared. You should be out there doing the very best you can. You put in your money for this business. So why aren't you working it? Can that make sense? So I want you guys to know you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Well, 9 days, not including today. 10 days, including today. 2, I'm busy, go, go, go. Sorry. You have nine days to get more sales. You have nine days. If you just sold $10 a day, you have nine days to get $90 worth of sales. 
You sold a six pack a day. That's ooh, 25, 50, 75, 100, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's 250 or 225. So you have time to get these sales. So here are some ways to get them. Since he has some awesome specials right now. First of all, call your repeat customers, call your past customers, and ask them if they need to restock. If they do, suggest a three pack, they save a dollar. Or better yet, buy five, and they, they get one free for 25. So call your people who you know may need, new, may need more wax and try to push for sales. If they say no, they say no, whatever. Move on to the next person. Tell them thank you, ask if they want a sample, and move on. So do that. Follow up with your customers. Number two, since he has some awesome specials right now. Boys, I told you to go play in the room or the living room. Gravy. Um, sorry, it's summer break. All my videos are going to have kids in it. So number two, the Father's Day bundle. You get an exclusive warmer, which is not available for anything else but the Father's Day bundle. It's really cute. It's a little grill. And you get three cents. Suggest that. Suggest the skin bundle for Father's Day. Um, we also have Indigo. Suggest that to your customers, guys. Indigo is amazing. If you haven't smelt it or bought it, do it. Invest in your business. It's $35 or $30. $30. So get it. It smells amazing. I've sold five, um, and that was before it was even out. So now I've sold a lot more. I don't know how many I've sold now because I've had people smelling it. They do have to get them all together. It's $30. You get all the sets. It's an exclusive bundle set. It's a multi-sensory experience, and they smell, smell fabulous. I mean, they're not like... They're not like fake kitty scents. They smell amazing. Invest in your business. Get one. 30 PRV. You get paid off of it. Do it. So Indigo. Next, your scent of the month. Your warmer of the month. If you are not subscribed for the scent of the month, I want you to do that. Okay, get the door open. Go, go in the living room. If you are not... Subscribe to the Scent of the Month. Do it. $35 a month. It comes to like $43 after tax and shipping. It is worth it. You get it. You get 10 bars of wax. Okay. Just these 10 bars is a $50 value. You can sell them and make your money back. Sell them for $5 flat because that's plus tax. And make your, make your money back, whatever. But you also get the flyers. You get the room spray. You get the big tester. You get the small tester. You get the scent of the month stickers. You get all of this in one little kit to help you market your business for the rest of the month. Invest in your business, guys. I guarantee if you are making samples, if you get the scent of the month, you take one bar, and I've been doing this because I feel that my customers get the most out of their set. I microwave it for 15 seconds, flip it over, microwave it for 15 seconds, and I cut it up. I cut each cube into thirds, and then maybe the bigger ones into fourths, because I kind of want them flat because I ship them. And I don't melt them down because I feel like that releases a lot of fragrance. Like, I was melting them down, and my kitchen would smell fabulous, but I, I was like, well, my customers probably aren't smelling it, so I've just been cutting them. But yeah, one bar will give you a ton of samples. It'll give you like 50 samples. Pass those out because you've got 50 flyers. Pair them together. Pass them out. Give them to some repeat customers. Give them to some new customers while you're out shopping. Pass them out. It's like you're giving somebody something free. Don't be silly or nervous about it. If they don't want it, they'll put it somewhere else or give it to somebody else. So... Be sure you are doing that. Warmer of the month. I don't subscribe to the warmer of the month because I don't want a bunch of warmers floating around. Um, some people do. And some people can sell them really good. If you feel like you know somebody, I do buy them if I feel like I know somebody will want them or if I want them. 
but um, I don't do a lot of events, so I don't sell them. So if you do, then perfect, get it. Another thing, closeout section. Post on your Facebook about the closeout section. Call your customers, suggest that they shop at the closeout section. They save money, you still get PRB, and you're getting paid. It's a business, you have to invest your time into it. You have to put a little bit of money into it, which you did when you signed up, you have to put your time into it. Because if you want to get paid as a part-time employee, then you have to work part-time. If you want to get a full-time paycheck, then you have to work full-time. You have to do this. Nicholas, I want you to go sit on that couch. Keep the penny, go sit on the couch. Leave my door alone. So, topic number two. End of the month crunch. Like I said, you have nine days, including today you have ten. It is time to get a party. So I want you to call some people today, message some Facebook friends, say, hey, can you do me a favor and have a Facebook party on Thursday? I'll throw in a free night light warmer. If they host a Facebook party and it's really good, you can get the warmer for half off. It's worth it. Um, if they don't do really good, then they don't get out. They don't get warmer. You know, just let them know it's with a qualifying party. <clears throat> so do that, okay? This is your paycheck, and I may sound like a little bit mean right now, but it's just really frustrating when people, you know, I know you guys can do it. It's really frustrating because I, I know $100, maybe to some people, isn't a lot. To me, that's a week's worth of groceries. And to invest in something and then not do anything to make that money back or do anything to make money off of a period when there's so much potential, it's frustrating. You know, how many people would kill for an opportunity like that? Take it. Use it. Do it. So, get a last minute party. Do your own last minute party. Do a home party. Step out of your bubble. Do something about it. Next thing. Now, we're going to talk about the future. I'm going to help you plan for your summer. Because I feel like that's maybe what is lacking here is people planning accordingly. You should always plan. If you're in the current month, you should always plan for the next month and the month after that. I always plan two months in advance. So my stuff in May was already booked in March. Okay. I do get periodically random other bookings, which is fine. But I try to book two months in advance. So right now I'm booking parties for June and July. In June, I'm going to be booking parties for July and August. So forth and so on. One, you're not rushing your hostesses. Two, you have plenty of time to plan. And three... You don't have to worry about it. I mean, if you book now for the summer, you don't have to worry about your summer getting last minute sales, crunching like I'm telling you to do now. You're good. So, I want you guys to go get your calendar. Pause this video if you need to. I will wait. Get your calendar. If you don't have a calendar, pause this video, go to the dollar store, buy a dollar calendar so you can have one. Or better yet, print one off. You can get a calendar. Super easy. Um... Next, get your list of 100. Do you have a list of 100? If you said no, what is a list of 100, Kayla? I've never heard of a list of 100. And you're showing me you didn't read your consultant guide. Open your consultant guide, find the list of 100. It will tell you how to do it. Do it. Pause this video. Go do your list of 100. All right. Now, you got your calendar. You got your list of 100. Your list of 100 is always changing. It's just 100 people that you know, and you know 100 people. You can't sit there and tell me you don't, because I will tell you you're wrong, and you do. So, you have your list of 100, you have your calendar, now we're going to fill in some dates. If you have plans this summer, fill them in. If you are working this summer, fill in the days that you're working. If you are going camping this summer, fill those in. Whatever you need to do, whatever you know in advance, fill it in now. Pause the video. Okay, moving on. Now I want you to circle 10 open dates. These are dates that are good for parties. If you want to mark Facebook parties like in the weeks, mark FB. If you want to do home parties on Saturdays, pick one Saturday a month, two Saturdays, whatever. Pick 10 good dates to do your parties. Okay. Now here comes the harder part. You have your list of 100 on your workstation. Pull up your contacts. And you're going to start making phone calls. All right. Your goal is to fill up all these 10 dates. Do it in 30-minute sessions. In those 30-minute sessions, 
Your goal is to get 10 no's. Yeah, you heard me right. I said to get 10 no's. Why would I want to get a no, Kayla? Let me tell you why. Because if you set a goal and you don't reach it, chances are you're going to be really, really discouraged. So this is a little bit of reverse psychology for you. If you get 10 no's, you're going to be like, heck yeah, I got 10 no's. Because statistically, every 10 no's, you'll get one yes. So, set aside 30 minutes, your lunch break, before you go to bed, whatever, while you're watching a show. Message people, call them, ask if they would like to do a party, ask if they need any more wax, if they're a repeat customer, ask if they want a sample. You know, ask. The worst thing they can do, not right now, I'm busy, the worst thing they can do is say no. And that's what you want. You get a no, you get a little check mark. And you guys get 10 no's. You have until, what's today? Sunday? I'm going to give you until Tuesday night to do this. Okay, because you need to get these parties booked as soon as possible. So I need you to get 10 no's by Tuesday night. I want you to show me your 10 no's. Um, and I want you to show me that you got 10 no's. So I want you to put post on this little link or right below on the, oh my gosh, my brain's turning to mush. On our Facebook page, right below, take a picture of your 10 no's. So I want you to do that. And then I want you to keep getting no's until all your dates are filled. Set it up, 30 minute increments. Do not make phone calls longer than 30 minutes because one, you're gonna get tired of hearing yourself talk. Two, you're gonna sound like this and your customers don't get anything to do with you. So 30 minute sessions, 10 no's. Every 10 no's, chances are you're gonna get a yes. These are statistics. So go for the no. Fill your calendar. Because then if you fill it, guess what? You don't worry about it the rest of the summer. Then, you know, you can maybe take a break in June and start filling up in July and August, you know? So, go for your 10 notes. Now, I already kind of talked about investing in your business, but this is something that I have come to realize that I'm going to have to do, and I've started doing more of it, and I've seen it really improve my business. So, invest in your business. One, sign up for the Sin of the Month kit, okay? It is worth it. It's a discount. All in all, you're really only paying like $1.50 for these bars. I mean, it's an awesome discount. Get it discounted. You can keep them or you can sell them. I use mine as like party gifts. So Lauren, this is a first order gift. She was the first to order at a party. She gets a gift. I'm not done. Please go. Um, these are from, oops, I think March. Country Plum, you know, this is my door prize, and she won a game, so game prize, door prize. So, I mean, I use them, the set of the month. This is, whoo, I am throwing things. <laughs> this is one of my game prizes. So, these were all Facebook games, too. Like, so I got orders This that my hostess reached her requirements to get hostess rewards. I mean, I... I just invested a little bit of money in these, and I, I give them as gifts. Now, you don't have to use that as gifts. You can sell them if you want. I just use mine as gifts. So, invest in your business. Another way to invest in your business is if, okay, I think everybody has an extra $35 a month if you spend your money wisely. And I think if you invest in your business wisely, you will see that it is an investment, and you're going to make more money off of it. So it is a smart choice. Another smart choice is customer service. Be the best you can be. Treat them how you want to be treated. Thank you notes. Every order that comes through me gets a thank you note. Whether it's with a party, whether it's online, whether it's some random person, they get a thank you note. It's a handwritten thank you note. It's not one of these pre-printed cards. I handwrite every single freaking thank you note. Thank you notes. Thank you for your business. Thank you for supporting your your hostess and getting her all these free goodies. Um, I would love to party with you. Would would you like to party with me? Something like that. And samples. Once again, invest in your business. These little discontinued testers 
were a prize gift. Okay. Um, it was a game I did. They got a little, they had some discontinued sisters. You can pop these suckers out and place them in the freezer and like package them cute. I was doing that. It took too long. So I just kind of give it to them like this and put a little note, say, place upside down in your warmer and enjoy. So invest, you know, samples. Those were already given to you. You have some. Um, when you signed up, you got two bars. Use one bar for samples, one for yourself. You use that perpetual reward to stock up on bars. You know, get three for seven dollars. Make samples. If you get the sin of the month kit, samples. Now in the in the family store, you have your laundry samples, laundry liquids, clothing conditioner samples, all the skin and groom samples. I mean, Cincy is making it super easy for us to have samples. Be generous. Not too generous. I save my most expensive samples for my most VIP customers. These are people I know who will buy. These are people who I treasure and enjoy, and I want them to keep coming back to me. Wax samples. Wax samples. Wax samples is about as cheap as you can get. Boys, please go. Not here. I'm busy. Please close my door and go. Now, wax samples are as cheap as you can make it. Okay, make some wax samples and enjoy and pass them out. Make sure you label them. Make sure they have your information. Um, I'm sorry, this video was a little long. I had a lot of interruptions. Um, I hope you guys forgive me for kind of slacking this last one. I did really bad. I apologize. That was all my fault. Um, and I hope you guys can kind of crunch and get your numbers in by the end of the month. If you are about to be inactive, try your best to stay active. I do not want to lose a team member, and I try my best to make, like maintain on top of you guys and let you know. Um, but this month I did slack off. So, do your best. So, I hope you guys have an awesome afternoon, an awesome day. Um, please let me know if you guys have any questions. I am here for you. Text me. Message me. I want to see you succeed in your business. I don't want to see that $99 flushed down the toilet. Okay? This is a life-changing business. It can be. You are in this business because you decided that you needed more money. And I want to help you make more money. I want to help you make the most of it. I want to help you succeed. If your goal is to make $500 a month, then tell me and we will make it happen. I will tell you how to work. I will tell you how much you need to work. If your goal is to make, you know, $100 a month, great. I'll tell you how to do that. I'll tell you how to work. If your goal is just to get free Sensi and discounts, then let me know. I will tell you how to reach your goal. I want to help you guys to reach your financial goals. I have an awesome, awesome sponsor, and she helps me so much, and I use her as a prime example to kind of guide and teach you guys, so I want to do that for you. I want to be that awesome sponsor for you guys, but I need you guys to communicate with me and to talk to me. If you're struggling, let me know, all right? We will make it work for you, I promise. So, anyway, enough of that. I hope you guys have a great day, and I love you so much, and I just want you to know that I am here for you, and have fun. Bye.